no cap only hair. It's it was headphone hair day, so we just went with this. Could have gone cap though. Good try, Boss Baker Chris. I can't pull off your hats though. How are y'all doing this morning? Happy time zone. We are done with the podcast. It was a lively discussion as it always is. Chat. Uh, we had fun. We laughed. We talked about pins. We talked about social media. Re Wizzles, 46 months of subbing. Two hands of blue, 26 months of subbing. Thank y'all so much. I appreciate y'all being here. Rattler Jen, jumping in there, 23 months of subbing. How are y'all doing today? Mobile Twitch, you nightmare. That should that's a that's a stream title if there ever was one, right? That is a stream title for sure. <clears throat> what is up? What is up? Mobile Twitch is trash. Yeah, I'm very rarely on there for sure. Caught up with my TPA pod backlog on a long drive. Always good to hear from guests and y'all. Fury and King. Hundred. Thousand ink drops, Toby. Hundred thousand ink drops. Let's do a giveaway. Cleaning and re-inking pens. Discovered that two of my bottles had gone off and a third was going. Oof. Gone off as in like ruined, like spoiled, or vanished. Oh, I said I was gonna do ink yesterday. Let's do this one. This is a rare ink. Rare ink time. Fury and King. Rare ink. So we have this, but specifically we have this. So this was, I don't have my desk cam set up yet. This was the Monarch ink from the Conid Boss Baker Chris with the 300 biddies. Let's go. So this came with the, um, the Conid Monarch from Fanta Plumo. So, there's this. Let me get my camera on real quick. I always forget that when it's time to stream from the podcast because I can't have this on. I can't have this on while I'm podcasting. Chada, 14 months of subbing. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. I just pre ordered my lunch for the DC show. I don't know why you just keep cracking me up with that, 11. Oh, Evan, 11. Are you on Stranger Things? It's hard to come down off the podcast high, but I'm here now. Whoa, Fury and King, I just cut off your alert. Nine months of subbing. Giveaway, redemption. Hmm. Oh, that's what we're doing later. Hmm. Can Brad technology today. Right now. Right now. About to pay off the bot. Oh, sorry about that pen. All right, that's what we're doing. KWZ Monarch. I think I probably filled this once with the Monarch pen, um, but I've sold, oh, Boss Baker Chris might have a pen that this color would match in. I don't know, I'm just saying. Hmm. <laughs> okay, there he is. There he is. I didn't even realize I had this. I probably should have maybe, oh, look at that. It made a ah face. Look at that, it's emoji. Listen, can Brad technology well on any other day? True. Imagine I used to be a technology guy. Imagine. This ink is much more affordable than the pen. This ink's only like two grand on eBay. The pen is probably like 200 grand on eBay. Schmevelin with the five gifted subs. Let's go. All right, let's get this giveaway going. Schmevelin, thank you so much. If you got a gifted sub from Schmevelin, give him a shout out. Check out your new meme. Um, words are hard, Chad. Check out your new emotes <laughs> as I try to get this giveaway going, but I'm too excited about it. KWZ Monarch. KWZ Monarch. All right, giveaways open. Exclamation point raffle. Thank you, Schmevelin. You can get the ink separately now, so it exists. Uh, so it's not that rare. So it's only like $200 on eBay still. That's a good ink. Schmevelin with the five gifted subs. I really, really appreciate you. Thank you so much. Good seeing the podcast stream this morning. You are up early, 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 early. So exclamation point raffle. Anyone can enter, anyone can win. Once the giveaway is live, type raffle to enter. Anyone can win worldwide, worldwide. You don't have to be a follower, member, subscriber. You don't have to live in the United States. We ship worldwide, worldwide. Whew. 
I've been sick all week. First day, I feel almost human. I feel that. I feel that. I was feeling less than human before the podcast today, but as I mentioned uh, in the members newsletter, recent members newsletter, it just gets me hyped. Did you see the new sticky notes on jet pens? No, but I'm about to. I am about to. Testing the theory if the bot can be bribed. There's a lot of bribery going on. Oh my gosh, is it these? So I had these before. This is my first dogs right here. But there's even better ones now. Cla oh, I didn't have this one. Claudette, Hunter, and Keiko. Oh my God, these are sick. One of them was named Toby. Do they have all of them listed here? So this was this is what got me into all the different sticky notes. Do they still have Toby's? Oh, these are all different. Wow. Oh no, here's the Toby's. So the top one there is Toby. <laughs> it's been so long since I've been able to join the Twitch. My new schedule keeps me away. We miss you too. I'm glad you're here. Ah, oh, these are sick. You should not have shown me these. Because there's like these dinosaurs. There's oh, there's bacon. What the heck? <laughs> Gretchen A. Berry, 28 months of summon. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you so much. Pilot now has a bacon inexpensive dis desk pen. What? Florence. Oh, Kevin. They did Kevin on the bacon. And Joe. What's Why is Florence the egg? Is like eggs Florentine or something? Like, we should just go ahead and make a cart, right? We're not going to. I mean, the dinosaurs are cute, but, I mean, bacon. I mean, look at this one. Jelly roll, flan, and boba. <laughs> Eggs Florentine's the only thing I can think of, yeah. God. Way to go, Paul. Oh, there's burbs. We got to look at all these now, chat. This is the stream. This is the stream. Ariel, Sky, and Melody. It's cool. We got to send those to Liz. Are there sloths? They're seals. So we have Samuel, Sia, and Chelsea. Stay focused. Why? Where's the squirrel sticker? Where's the squirrel one? Naya, Zola, Peebo. <laughs> these are great <laughs> these are great yeah we gotta send those burbs to Liz or something oh Umai, Haku, and Maki I think it's bacon and sushi are the winners so far penguins are Iris, Bjorn, and Elsa alright what else am I supposed to look at those are little. Oh my God! <laughs> Lee loves gaming at night. What did you even walk into today? Thank you for the follow. <laughs> what did you even walk into today? Oh my God! My dog is Elsa. Might have to get those right. Where are the raccoons? That's a good point. We need a. We need. We need a trash panda edition. So it'd be. Raccoon, squirrel, and a possum. They added instructions for Brad. <laughs> yeah, we need we need a trash panda edition. Raccoon, squirrel, possum. I'm free for uh, consulting work. Uh, girl of all work. Dotsons. Yeah. Southern fried. Raccoon, squirrel, possum. Done. These sushis are too happy to be questionable. <sighs> what else am I supposed to look at? Pilot something something. Pilot desk fountain pen, that one? What am I looking at? What did you say? Mm -mm -mm. Oh, the maroon desk. Bacon, 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 bacon. Gotcha, gotcha. So, yeah, bacon colored uh, desk pen. 
I don't think I've ever tried the Pilot Desk Pen. I like my desk pens. I can't find my Lamy Joy. No Jai. I, I know I owe y'all a giveaway winner here, but this is this is good stuff. I hate when I place a Jet Pens order. What is this? And there's more stuff. That's too many words I can't pronounce. I'll just let y'all read it. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Thank you, Miss Cheese. <laughs> Just got home from scratching a therapy pig. That sounds amazing. This entire stream is going to be a letdown from this point forward, chat. Just so y'all know, there's a Rotring in gold and white. Did they bring the High Ace Neo back? If you've never been to the stream before, welcome. Anthracite. This is where Brad completely loses the plot. I mean, give me white, but still. That looks too silver. I want the pencil in white. I don't need a bunch of pens. Did you end up talking about Muji yesterday? We ended up talking about Muji on the podcast today. What do we need to talk about? This is the only decent sailor entry level pen and it's really kind of overpriced for what it is. But oh, it's a stub nib. Oh. Uh, that's not bad. That's pretty cool then. I mean, I'd still rather have a Platinum Preppy. Don't like the gold, I have a white and it's a nice finish. Yeah, it'd be the same. Y'all get to see me looking around. I, instead of looking at this screen that I'm showing y'all, I'm looking around my camera to see the bigger picture on my monitor. <sighs> Thanks, the poor Pinman. That wasn't my fault today. I feel like that was Paul's fault. Dragon Drawer with the gifted sub. Thank you so much. Enjoy the gifted sub degree code. Have you talked about the pinning cell of Pelican? Just in passing. Uh, I think it's going to be super interesting. Because where we reside as fountain pen fans mostly um, is such a small percentage of usage. Um... Which was interesting to see Joshua lay out there in the, in the post. So, yeah, solidarity. Thanks. All right, let's solidarity a giveaway winner because y'all have been very patient with my distractions. Pick a winner. To live and dice in LA. That's got to be a first time winner. Are you here to live and dice? To live and dice in LA. It came up 20s. That's you. Congrats. You are the winner. So here's what you have to do. Professional lurker, I love it. I love professional lurkers. You can lurk all you want. You never have to say a word, except if you win, you have to be present to win, which means you gotta say, hey. And now you email me your shipping address, hello at penaddict.com. Let's see here. Hey, thank you. Thank you for lurking. Seriously, I, I genuinely mean that. All right, so email me, and I'll get this out later this week. All right, got it. There we go. All right, so thus concludes the enjoyable part of the stream. <laughs> now I get to make a spreadsheet. Aren't y'all thrilled? Look at this, though. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. It's Prime Day. Did you list equipment stuff and use for the ink sample trace? I did not. 
I didn't think about doing that for Prime Day because I'm not smart enough to manage that. But when I do write it up, I will uh, do that. Surprised that isn't handcuffed to the wrist of a pilot employee, right? So they sent um, they sent Takasumi with it. We'll talk about this. This is more exciting than a spreadsheet. They sent Takasumi with it. I hope they don't mind. I'm going to use Pilot Blue Black. Psychic Macaroni, 10 months of subbing. Yeah, I can say what they have. Warning for those who do spreadsheets professionally, Brad's spreadsheets are painful. Uh, factually correct. Uh, no argument from me. But this one, this one's so basic, I can only screw it up so much. So there is some, there's not any hope for me. Like it's still going to be bad, but it's limited. The, the poor spreadsheeting is limited today because it's literally number, ink name. So we'll be all right, mostly. It is, and they sent the, uh, all right, let's do this real quick. Well, we might as well do this, right? Who was the winner? Um, it, w it was you, Geekfish. And then you didn't answer, so you lost. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it was to live in Dice in LA. It wasn't you. It was not you. Uh, dun, dun, dun. Secondary pins reveal tomorrow. Yes, it is on the list. Um, I guess these are converters too. So I took a picture of them this morning on Instagram. Yeah. Ooh, all con 70s. We are definitely not using these, chat. What I think I'm going to do is I'm going to use an ink cartridge and just kind of uh, move it around as we go. So, pilot uh, corporate gift. Not really. This is just a sticker they put on a pin case. All right. Extra fine. I'll open some of these later. Y'all know what an extra fine nib looks like. Fine. I did. I do sort. I have them sorted. Are there any pilot converters you actually like? Oh, I love this Con 70. It's just horrible. It's the best of a bad situation. Take all the stickers off, right? Pilot soft fine. Imagine. Yeah, we're leaving the stickers on. There's one without a sticker, though. Waverly, I think it doesn't have a sticker. Fine medium. So if Ink Dependence Mike comes in, this is the these are the this is the same set that he had and did all the videos on. Soft fine medium. I kind of want this one just because the name is stupid. That's a lot of names for a nib. Move the stickers around. Dang. Like this is probably like a really kind of perfect nib. What's a fine neat medium? Exactly. And this one's a soft fine medium, so there you go. But to them, it's technically in between fine and medium, which is just... Phew. You wondered if the same set Mike has? Yeah, this one's making the rounds. It's my turn currently. Medium. I said I wasn't going to open all these. Mike already moved the stickers. True. What type of pen, it, pen is it? It is a Pilot Custom 912. And with the 912, they have 15 nib options with it. Soft medium. That's a popular one. broad this one as i learned today pilot calls a broad broad not a double broad it's a bb what's funny is the sticker has triple b on it oh the b has double b <laughs> the ms is music it has bms and that's like a bowel movement syndrome or something why are so many people selling the soft fine on Slack? What makes them different? The thing that makes them different is that they're different. Like, and I, I mean that in dead seriousness. Like, it's just not the norm. So it seems to be like a popular thing when it's not the norm. Um, the music is probably like a better stub nib than their stub nib. Um, it's a, it still has the two uh, slits in it, three times two slits. I'm interested to try this one to see if I like it better than the stub. See if I get any more... Um, line variation so that one is going to be very interesting for me to try and then we have my 912 is a po and it's one of my favorites that is the correct answer get composite so sue is sue tab which is stub 
So it's a little bit more blocky, which when I take pictures of these, you'll be able to see it better. It's a little bit more blocky than the music. And I didn't get enough line variation. This is the set that Mike just reviewed. That's correct. So if someone has a link to those um, reviews, I put it in the podcast today. But if someone has a link to that handy, y'all can throw that in here. Mike has a whole like a, um, a link to all the videos on this. So this is the course nib. This is kind of Sailor Zoomish, right? These are the these are the interesting nibs here, right? It's just a big round metal tipping here. It's almost like extra tipping just added on the end of the pen. Definitely not gonna like that one, but that's okay. There's 15 of them. The, okay, so this is the actually this is the number one. These came from Pilot themselves. They're on loan. This is the number one and one I want to try, Waverly. So Waverly has a turned up nib, but it's just enough. Brightsmith, thank you for the follow. Appreciate you. Thank you, Rewizzles. So Mike, uh, Ink Dependence Mike, has a whole video series on this exact set that I have here. It's a hog nose nib. So I'm interested to see if this works for me. Because I think it's going to be fine enough. And I think I might like the little variation that it offers. So that's next on my shopping list. So then the FA is one of the more popular non-standard nibs. It's a very springy, bouncy nib. I have this in my 743 and I love it. Love, love, love this. So this is if you want some flex. Yeah, Toby's playing with his toys, so he's having fun right now. Oh, tomorrow, Toby haircut day. That's right, getting it cut off. It's going to be the best day of the summer, buddy. And then, last but not least, save the best for last, yada yada, P.O. P.O. is the best nib for me. You should not buy the P.O. nib unless you've tried a P.O. nib. It is a nail. It writes like a nail. It's supposed to write like a nail. So this is a turned down Basically a turned down, extra fine, extra firm nib. So this is one of the best nibs ever. So PO the best. It is. It is. So there you go. It's a, like an EEF nail. Exactly. So if you are in the camp that would like an extra, extra fine nail, you should look at the PO. If you are not, you should stay far away from it. PO is one of my favorite nibs. Yep. Will you bring these to, to DC? Um, Pilot will have them on their table. I don't know if I will be done with this before DC to send them back or to bring them. I don't know. We haven't discussed that. We've only dis discussed the fact that, hey, I'm not really fast at turning these things around. It's like, you can go to someone else if you want before me. And they're like, nah, we'll just send them to you. I'm like, okay. Okay. Any stores between St. Louis and Nashville I need to stop at this weekend? I don't know. Does anyone have an answer? So Pilot has this tray, but I don't know if this is like the literal tray. Like, do they have two sets of these? Like, do I need these back before DC? We'll see. We shall see. All right. We can keep talking, but I'm typing. Good morning, Brad. Kitchen reno, day three, house is noisy. I just need to buy pens to stop thinking about it. Factually correct. We just had the lawnmowers out during the podcast. Toby went ballistic for about a second. Then he was like, eh, I don't really care. I see these guys all the time. Um, and then I can't get, I have electrical work that needs to be done that I can't seem to get done. So that's on the cards too. And I'm not even typing in the right thing. All right, so I'm just gonna type. Y'all keep talking. And y'all can yell about my spreadsheet if you want. I really just need a, a tracking list. So I really don't care what you think. <laughs> I'll do the electrical work. You rewired the entire house? Dang. Connor, you just missed the fun part of the stream. Now this is the suck part of the stream where I just type words on a spreadsheet. 
<laughs> we were looking at animal sticky notes and pilot nibs, and now I'm going to a spreadsheet. Man, good timing, Connor. Um, so yeah, so I have two breakers that keep tripping, and that is way above my pay grade. Even I don't even care if y'all tell me that's going to be easy or something. Like, pass. Oh, what am I doing here? And one of them is for my air conditioner, which is not good. Oh man, what did you say? Did you say I'm terrible? Oh, fair, 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 fair. <laughs> yeah, electrical and plumbing. I can do, I mean, I'll do the basic toilet stuff, but I'm not gonna do like pipe stuff. And I'm sure as heck not gonna mess with the electricity. Except the problem is I called them, uh, <laughs> how do you think his hair got that way? Damn. Um, the problem why I'm angsty about it is, um, this has been going on since Monday. Like I called them Monday morning. I had to call them before the podcast today. I'm like, where are we at? And they're like, hey, how about tomorrow? I'm like, you mm, mother truckers, right? Yeah, getting electrocuted is not on my list. What's your involvement in the backpack world like? I need a new one and have a lot of specific requirements. That's an ink dependence mic thing. I was very deep into it probably like six or seven years ago and could handle like most of your needs and get you a good answer. Um, and I'm out. And Mike is very, Mike is dialed in. So I would hit ink dependence mic. Yeah, if he's on later. We can throw it over there later. If he's on at noon, we'll throw it over. Or you can jump over and ask him. Um, I'm probably going to bail after I finish this sheet. I mean, this isn't going to take long. Because I've already done the podcast. It's already almost noon. I don't even know what knob and tube wiring is, but that scares me. He's back to Tuesday and Thursday streaming. Gotcha. So we can throw it to him tomorrow. What was that? L. Kirby. Us. U.S. 29 months of subbing. Tuesday, Thursday. Okay, cool. Is he doing summer school or is he just like cutting back the, uh, cutting back the hours? What's up, Toasty Treat? I feel like I took your name in vain the other day. I mean, when don't I? But oh, I still gotta, I gotta, still gotta test out this platinum Mount Fuji. I need to write that down. All right, we gotta write that down, chat. Is platinum Mount Fuji the same? You sent me two emails, one just tracking. Cool, I've sent you zero. You're up. You're winning. Oh, get him. Get him, Toby. Eric, small things class popped off. I mean, I would I would cue for that, to be perfectly honest, if I was going. Like I would have I would have made it. You didn't do anything. I don't I can't remember. It probably wasn't bad. It was probably, oh, you know what it was? 
I think I was just following up on the Portland Pin Show if anyone got Olive, uh, Oblation Olive. That was also, I didn't take your name in vain. Dun dun. I'm debating the Wax Seals class at DC. That actually sounds pretty cool. I haven't even looked. Oh man, what do we do here? I'm a, so this we're gonna go Pannonia. Is Eric here? Gamma Gamma. Try to sign up the stamp class at SF and both were full. Rip. I'm with you. Like I said, I would have queued up. I would have like I would have camped out overnight for tickets. <laughs> you should sign up for CTFJ's new letter. What is that? Am I gonna do the DC puzzle competition? I don't even know what this is. Explain. Email from Esther Brook came yesterday. I'm so confused right now. Cute things from Japan, okay. I do need to sign up for that. Pin show after dark puzzle competition. No, I haven't seen this. And I've literally been texting Carrie for like two days straight. Why didn't he tell me? I've literally been in his DMs for the past two days. Gosh, I feel like we need a soundtrack for this. This is boring. But if I don't do it now, I'm not going to do it. All right, teams of four racing get time, 9 p.m. Well, it was probably because I was making Carrie do work. All right, we'll put that up later. Keyboard ASMR is a whole genre. That's exactly right. Did y'all think I would actually finish this project? I mean, odds were always against me. Cling Nur. Maybe had doubts. Yeah, facts. Like uh, y'all aren't wrong. Y'all literally aren't wrong. I mean, I know myself. Four. <laughs> Stupid alignment. The pipetta was a game changer. True. True. That's all y'all's y'all's fault. Y'all got me through, chat. Good job by you. Y'all did it. Please don't go today without mentioning the ink files and tray. What if I don't? No, I'm not selling it. 
I'm going to use that again. We're going to make more samples. We got to get rid of this ink. That's how we're going to get rid of ink. It's fun and it's your fault. What's the brand name? You embarrass me by crying at the pin show. I'll cry with you so we'll be embarrassed together. Um, all right, so what's the brand name of Taranishi, Guitar, Taisho, Roman, Nostalgic Honey? What's the actual brand? Is it Taranishi or is it Guitar? Or is it Taranishi, Guitar? Brand name is Taranishi Chemical Industries. Okay, thank you. That actually helps. Yeah. We're having a group cry at a pin show. We can do. Line is guitar, tie show room. Perfect. Then I had it. I actually had it written right, which is a freaking miracle. Taranishi. So then we're going to go guitar. Oh, I didn't even validate that these numbers are correct. Okay, we're on line. Tw I just did all this. Yeah, we're on line 24, and that is ink number 24. Okay, I numbered it correctly. I probably should have checked before halfway through. <sighs> All right, this is freaking dropping. I think we're going to just make a class session for uh, how do I line this left or just make it text? Twenty-five. Call. Tony should just launch a shimmer series. Interesting. Got to go pack for a big trip. Nice. Ooh, five a.m. flight. That's rough. Linen toolbar. Linen toolbar. Brought a Cortex Blue Mark one the night before they released the new limited edition color. Well, which one do you like better? Uh, I don't think Cortex has a discount code. Nothing that I've ever used. Bung Box Supernova. Nice. Anyone coming on Thursday for DC Pin Show? What am I coming? Put a single quote in front of the one of the Nice. When am I coming in? I think I'm not coming until Friday. Like that? Yeah. Man, game changed. Game changed. <laughs> I have no clue. Sweet. Thank you. <laughs> kind of like the LE better, but it's close enough. I don't want to make a return. Backs. When is my, I don't think I'm coming until Friday. Now you got me curious. That's all right. Yesterday, I thought I booked my Chicago trip for the wrong day, so that was cool. Yeah, I come in Friday. Rip. R.I.P. Mm -mm. 
Ooh. I don't know how to spell this one. Kingdom note. High no high no bias. Yeah, San Francisco is going to be dope this year. I'm interested to see how the new hotel goes. I'm sure it's fine. I'm not going to SF. Yeah, I'm not going to SF. My arm keeps trying to be perpetually twisted, but it's not going to happen. Especially if I'm going to Orlando, too. So that'd be three in a row with like two weeks between each. I wish. I'm really going to take next year's... Um, pin show schedule planning a little bit more seriously get it done ahead of time and see if I can work out some of the shows that I haven't been going to Who needs money and fam hanging with family, right? And stress <laughs> and anxiety. I had a ton of miles, so my flight was free. Yes, yeah, St. Louis is perpetually on my list. It is the single worst scheduled for me show of the year, though, unfortunately. All right, thank y'all for allowing me to do that. So, yeah, I'm thinking uh, Portland and Amsterdam, or maybe Portland and Boston, or Portland and New York. Uh, maybe new LA. I don't know. All right, let's see this. What is this? Nice puzzle competition. Cool. That should be fun. I will be a I will be a great um, observer. Oh yeah, Boston. Uh, the hotel couldn't manage it. It was just kind of like an unfortunate situation type of thing. The hotel was not ended up being not prepared, just from staffing and other issues or 